Hello, my most amazing artists. So this is Honoré Matisse, Matisse, and we are going to draw his fish bowl or fish cylinder. This is a cylinder shape that he puts his fish in in his painting. So let's get started with Matisse and our fish cylinder. First shape is a big oval at the top. Make sure it's really wide. Fill up that top area of your paper. We don't want small little cylinders. I'm going back over my line. You are using a pencil, of course. Next step is two lines. One line right here at the end, right there at the very end of the oval, and right at the very end of this oval, going down, but not all the way down, so watch. Right about there, one straight line. Mine's a little wavy, is that okay? Yes, that's okay. And then same on this one at the very end of the oval, straight line going down and it ends where there's still enough room at the bottom. Don't want to go all the way too far down, but that's okay if you do because you have an eraser on your pencil. Awesome. Now we're going to close this off, but not a straight line. It's going to be a rainbow line. I'm actually going to turn my cylinder around, boom, and make a rainbow line. Watch. There we go. Good job following along with Miss Decora. We have a cylinder, my friends. Oh my goodness. So now let's do maybe the table. If you friends don't wanna do this part, that's okay. There's just background and it's blank and I really want to fill it up with some fun stuff so I'm actually going to make the table like Matisse does in his painting. I do this by making this line and then the same line on the other side. Beautiful work my friends. Now besides the cylinder, the fish, and the table, there's lots of leaves and plants around his fish cylinder. So I'm going to add some leaves everywhere. Do you have to copy Miss Decora? No, you can make up your own leaves or own, maybe you want flowers instead. Maybe you want something completely different in the background. But if you want to follow Miss Decora, you can. I'm making little shapes all the way around. This one looks like a heart. The other ones look like tear drops or rain drops. This one over here, I know you can't see it, but it is another heart shape. So you can play around. You do not have to do what Mr. Core is doing. Maybe you make up your own thing, or maybe you do want to make some fun leaves behind your cylinder. Up to you, friends. You are the artist. Now there is one more important step that I really want us to do. So please do it with Miss Decora. There's another oval in there and Miss Decora's gonna draw it right now. It's right underneath our first oval, that first shape we made right away. It's a second oval. This will show a reflection or the top of the water that's filled inside the cylinder. And again, it goes right on those lines. It's really wide. All right, let's see what Miss Decora makes. Ooh, <gasps> whoa. So my friends, you get to draw fish however you like. Maybe you don't even want fish. Maybe you want an octopus. Maybe you want a shark inside your cylinder fish bowl. Whatever it is, have fun with it. Maybe do something fun with them as, like Mr. Cora did by making them have a birthday party. 
Be creative. What do you want inside your fish cylinder? I cannot wait to hear. Maybe it's a mermaid. Maybe it's a person going scuba diving. Up to you, my friends. Cannot wait.